Hello everyone, welcome to Dr. Yang's Live Tape channel. If you are new to my channel, please remember to subscribe to my channel. You will not miss any new videos in the future. Today, the topic I'm going to talk to you about COVID-19. COVID-19 is one of the biggest pandemic of 100 years in the human history. However, after 10 to 11 months in many countries, the government and the people are still struggling to control the spread of the virus. Actually, many doctors think the mask is one of the best methods so far to protect you and protect others from the COVID-19. So I just checked the internet, the latest information about COVID-19 worldwide. If you look at the total positive cases up to 13th November 2020, the cases cumulative total have reached 55 million worldwide, among which USA have over 10 million people are positive to COVID-19, India have 9.7 million, and Brazil have 5.7 million, France 1.9 million, Russia 1.8 million, Spain 1.48 million, and UK just passed 1.3 million today. But even after 11 months later on, still so many people do not want to wear a mask. But today I just give you some evidence to show you why mask is so critical for protecting you and others to against COVID-19 pandemic. If you look at this figure, the COVID-19 positive patient on the left hand side, if a healthy people on the right hand side, if both the patient and the health people, they do not wear mask when they meet, the health people will have 90% risk to catch the virus. However, when the two people meet, the patient do not wear mask, but the health people wear mask, then the health people may have 30% of the risk to catch the virus. If we change the position, when the two people meet, the COVID-19 positive patient wear a mask, but the health people do not wear a mask, then the health people have 5% risk to catch the virus from the patient. In other situation, if the two people meet together, both the patient and the health people wear masks, then the health people only have 1.5% risk to catch the virus. In the best situation, if both the health people and the patient wear masks when they meet, and also they maintain the two meter distance is six feet the distance, social distance. In that way, the health people only have 0.1% of the risk to catch the virus. Why I put 0.1, which means it's not 100% you will be protected. It's better you do not in close contact with patient. Okay, in that way, you may ask me, what's the best way to protect ourselves? Let's look at this slide again. The best way to protect you away from the COVID-19 is you must wear a mask when you meet with other people. Even you do not know if they are patient or not, you have to presume they are positive to COVID-19. If they do not wear a mask, you shouldn't too close to them or you shouldn't to meet with them. So you never try to meet anyone who do not wear a mask because you do not know if they are positive to COVID-19 or not. You do not know if they are patient or not. And when you meet with someone who wear a mask, you also wear a mask, you still need to keep a two meter or six feet the social distance, which make you are safe to protect you and protect your family. If you meet someone, you both wear a mask, are you safe? 
if you do not keep the 2 meter social distance, you still have 1.5% of the risk you will catch the virus from the patient. If you meet someone who have the virus, who wear a mask, however you do not wear a mask, then you will increase your risk to catch the virus to 5%. When you wear a mask, you meet with someone who have virus but who do not wear a mask. Then if they talk to you or they sneeze against you, then you will have 30% of chance to catch the virus. So do not feel once you wear a mask, you completely safe. So this is very important. Another condition even worse, if you meet with someone, you do not wear a mask and the patient of the 19 positive people also do not wear a mask. Then you meet together, you talk together, you will have 90% of risk to catch the virus. So this is very, very dangerous. Let's look at these slides. How many people died from the COVID-19 until yesterday, 13th November 2020? Up to yesterday, the death cumulative total worldwide have over 1.3 million people. For the US alone, the deaths so far is over 248,000 people from the COVID-19. Brazil alone is more than 164,000 people dead. And India alone, the deaths so far is over 128,000 people. And the maximum deaths is 97,000, but the UK death rate up to yesterday is over 51,000 people dead from the COVID-19. So from this number you can see, it's really a serious problem. These figures provide a direct evidence to show you how serious this pandemic. It is one of the largest pandemic of 100 years in the human history. Everyone should action now to protect yourself, protect others, and protect the economic, and protect our job. If the pandemic continue for the next few months or years, so it will be greatly damaged to our economic, and will be damaged to our job opportunity, will damage for the life of everyone. So this is very important. Please do wear the mask when you meet with others, Keep the social distance, wash your hand and often, and do exercise, sleep well, and eat well to make yourself much stronger so that you can protect yourself, avoid the catch the virus, and avoid spread the virus to other people. So this is very important. If you are the health people, you need to look after yourself. If you already got a positive COVID-19 virus, again, you need to wear the mask when you meet with others. This will make sure you can offer to protect your family and protect your friends and protect other people around you. This is very important. Do not ignore the message. If you like my video, please sum up. Please also subscribe to my channel. You will not miss any future video.